Hey everybody, it's Brian with Engadget. Uh, my apologies for not looking directly at you, but we're actually trying out a retina controlled TV. We're at the higher booth at IFA. Uh, this is really cool. They just calibrated it for me. You can see the little retina control below me. And by looking at stuff, I can select it. So looking at the screen right now, and I'm gonna select that main image by blinking. Give it a good blink. There we go. It's a little hard to get used to. Uh, small blinks don't really do it, I assume, because you're just doing sort of regular blinks when you're uh, watching the television. But uh, I can control the volume. Turning the volume down right now. And turning it up. Selecting by blinking. I just muted it. And turn it up now. I don't know what's going on actually with the calibration. Uh, it's a little imperfect as you can tell. Oh, something, something's a little off now. Um, when it works, it's really cool, but uh, it's a little hit or miss right now. All right, there we go. So we're back in the video. I'm gonna go to the menu and select a new video. Go down to the volume, turning the volume down. Uh, so really, it's just a matter of looking at icons, staying on them. So I can use this to change channels, I can use this to change the volume, I can look at pictures. It's really just, you know, the, the places on the television that I'm looking, I can also control those spots as well. So, air, volume, muting it, turning it down. Uh, it's really cool, a little bit imperfect right now, but uh, this is a prototype and, you know, uh, we're not really sure what the price is or when this is going to be available in your home, but uh, can't wait to try out a more, uh, more finalized unit.